Hello and welcome to Dedicated Dentist 32 Reasons Why. So today in this video, we'll talk about time management tips during exams. Keep watching till the end. So, time management is something you cannot do when you reach the exam hall. Your notes, presentation and state of mind plays a pivotal role in this. Today, I will talk about tips on management of time and also in the end of the video, we'll talk about the signs of taking down notes. So yeah, bear with me. This I already talked about in one of my video with the title how to score more in dentistry. You may check that out that instead of writing your answer in essay or para represented in tabular form of flowcharts also draw diagrams more than the writer so this will also save your time in your examiners so he or she may give you good marks as a reward for sparing him from reading two page essays so make notes efficiently and so we'll get to this at the end of the video so first thing state of mind now keep calm Many a times it happens that you have studied almost everything, still you fail to express in viva or present in paper because you are stressed. So think positive. Even if you know 50% of paper, give your 100% to it, okay? Because when you generate the positive thoughts, your cortisol decreases and brain produces serotonin and you get less anxious, much calmer and more focused. Speaking from my personal experience, my friends, they studied less than me or a night before exam and still they were an epitome of optimism. And they got marks very close to as mine. So no negative self-talk during exam, only focus. Second thing, tick tock of the clock. Now keep track of time from the beginning and don't distract yourself. Uh, a day before exam or whenever possible, do the distribution of time, excluding 10 minutes from total duration, as these 10 minutes will be utilized for the pending answers. Assign each question a time limit. If that time limit exceeds or you cannot remember, proceed with the next question. But don't waste time thinking over the same question. Always always maintain the sequence because this puts a bad impression on the examiners and that irritates really and complete the unanswered question during the last 10 minutes if any or draw the diagrams or you may underline the keywords this way you will never have any question unanswered okay attempt every question possible now next presentation like I already said make flowcharts tables and draw diagrams and write answer in points with spacing now how to make short and easy notes? Don't write long sentences or write everything that's given in textbook as it is. I will give you an example. Don't skip this, it's really important. You will understand the art of taking down notes. I'm reading out a para and later will turn it into a short answer. So again, bear with me. Center of resistance. Now, central resistance of a tooth can be defined as that point on the tooth when a single force is passed through it would bring about its translation along the line of action of the force. Generally, the center of resistance of a tooth is constant. In single rooted tooth, it lies between one third and one half of the root, apical to the ampullar crest, while in multi rooted tooth, the center of resistance lies between the roots, one to two mm apical to percussion. The central resistance exists for a single tooth, units of tooth, the entire dental arch and the jaws. Knowing the location or the center of resistance is thus very important in planning appropriate mechanotherapy. Factors which can change the position of central resistance are the root length, alveolar bone height. Longer the root, the center of resistance will be placed more apically. Likewise, if the alveolar crest is higher, the center of resistance will be placed more coronally. Similarly, the morphology and the number of roots also influence the location of center of resistance. You see how we converted a paragraph into diagrams and presentation is also on fleek. Regardless of your drawing skills, you draw. Okay? It need not be perfect. So your answer sheet speaks that your concepts are clear and this also saves your time. If you cannot appreciate here on the answer, you can visit my Instagram for dental notes and videos so with that we sum up i wish you luck and if these things help like share and subscribe dedicated dentist signing off thank you